So a common request we get is how can you check the t transmission temperature in your Porsche vehicle, whether it's a PDK or a Tiptronic. Where if you're wanting to change the uh, the, the oil in your transmission gearbox, then you will generally need to know the temperature before you can drain the fluid. It needs to be drained at a certain temperature. Um, so we get we get requests from people asking which tool will allow us to check the temperatures before they drain the oil. Um, and this is the tool we'd always recommend. It's a POR version 3.0 tool. And I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. Right now it's a 2013 Porsche 991 Carrera S with a PDK transmission. So I'm gonna to go to Diagnostics, I'm gonna to go to Porsche, and then I'm gonna to go to Vehicle Select 991 Control Unit. Make sure the, uh, well, the engine is running in this particular case, but we'll go to Transmission Control, and then we go to View Data, and we scroll down to Temperatures. And then here we've got the transmission sump temperature, the actual value, the automatic transmission fluid is um, 40 degrees I, I, I do call it oil but it's a fluid um, and input signals from data was engine temperature actual values that's at 71.25 uh, degrees Celsius it's showing in okay um, you might be able to change that into Fahrenheit if you want it in the settings somewhere you can change like the values or the uh, the, the measurements the metrics uh, but right now we've got it set to 40 uh, Celsius uh, so that's how you would find the data <clears throat> it's really simple actually um, and on top of all of that you know you've got the tool which does um, it can allow you to diagnose all of the main systems in the vehicle it'll do service functions I may as well show you while I'm here uh, we do have a couple of faults in this transmission system which we do need to look at uh, but I'll scroll through the system and it'll give you live data and you can read faults do bi-directional actuation tests in all of these systems just as we're going through here and then you can do like service functions as well. So if we go back to the main menu, I'm gonna go service functions and depending on what's installed to your vehicle, you can do some of these service functions as well. All right, but as I say, I'll pop the link to this kit in the description below this video. There are fakes, there are clones out there that can damage your vehicle. It's really not worth going down that route, so I'd certainly recommend using the link below. That will take you to the genuine and official product. Thanks for watching, guys, and I hope this helps.